Hey guys, so today we're going to be trying out a new tool from Revlon. It is the Salon One Step Hair Dryer and Styler. So it says the power of a dryer, precision of a styler. So I usually have to blow dry my hair and then spray you know, a bunch of hair products in it and then go in with a hair straightener and or a hair curler. So this kind of lets you dry it and style it at the same time. So we are going to give it a try. I know it's going to be super loud. so. I might kind of turn the sound off and put some music overlay for part of this just because you don't need to see all of it. But my hair has been air drying for about an hour or so. So it's not like intensely wet, it's more damp. So we're gonna see how this works on kind of like damp hair. So it looks like this. It looks like a hairbrush. It's pink and black. And at the bottom is the on and off switch. You turn it to turn it on. It has a cool, a low and a high setting, so let's give this a try. Okay, so as you can see, the one strip is dry and smooth. So it does work really well. So I'm going to hop off, finish the rest of my hair, and then I can show you what it looks like when it's all said and done. And I'll also let you know about how long it took to dry my hair. We'll call it 11.55 right now, so I'll be right back. Okay, so this is what my hair looks like when I'm done using that Revlon hair dryer and styler tool. My hair is definitely much straighter than it was when it was wet. My hair is naturally curly, so it did a good job of straightening everything out. Is it super sleek like it would be with a hair straightener? No, but if you're looking to skip a step in the mix of your day, if you're looking to shorten your get ready time, I think this is a nice option. I don't think that it would work super well on like right out of the shower hair where it's soaking wet. I think it definitely needs to towel dry and air dry first. Um, just brushing it through, it's not going to adequately dry soaked hair or it would just take a very long time. So with my hair being damp, it took about five minutes to dry and straighten my hair, which I think is a really good time. Um, like I said, I mean, it's, it's easy to hold. I like the controls. I like the setting. The brush is nice. It doesn't hurt my head. Just brushing down this way, though, I don't think you're going to get it dry enough. I had to flip my hair upside down and brush this way to really get it dry all the way to the roots back here. Um, so I ended up combing this way, combing this way, just to make sure that the air was really circulating all around my hair from root to tip. So do I think this is a good product? I do actually, I'm gonna to continue to use this one. My husband's gonna be sad that I'm gonna be putting the hair dryer away for a while because he uses it too. Um, but I think this is a nice product and if you're looking to get a gift for someone that dries their hair, straightens their hair and styles it, this would be a great gift idea because it cuts out some of the steps and some of the products. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review of the Revlon tool. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.